Hey, hey, welcome back. So this is our last video so far in this series. Now, in this video, I want to show you how to how are we going to have an um, app icon for this app. So I will drag this out like that. Uh, let's minimize this. OK, and now for this launch, um, actually, where is it? Images dot We have the app icon and this this is some I prepare for you the app icons. OK. All we need to do is just drag it like that into this. OK, um, let's see. I will have the standard editor and click into app icon again and I will drag it like that. OK, there we go. OK, so now when I run this. OK, and I will go back home. Well, it doesn't change it. Well, let's try to do this. OK, I just move it into that. Well, actually, this way is not the the best way to do this because the app icons, there is a bunch of app icons like you have the iPhone 4, iPhone 5, iPhone 6, 6 plus. Not to mention that you have some when if you publish into the app store, you have the app store icons, a bunch of things. OK, and if we have if we get a chance in the in the next course, I will talk about how are you going to do this. And actually, if you look at this, this is the sunshine. OK, and this app, we built a weather app and it has um, a bunch of app icon, a bunch of um, custom design. OK, and I will show you how to custom design that using something on called sketch. This is very easy to use. I am not a designer at all, but it is so easy to use. OK, and now let's run this again. OK, and you see that this uh, that changes. OK, and it's because this is the iOS 7, iOS 860 points. Um, that is for the iPhone app. This is iPhone Spotlight. This is iPhone Spotlight for iOS 8, uh, 5, 6 and the settings. OK. So you see that there is a bunch of icon apps, app icons. OK, now how about this? We will go to the launch screen and who cares about that? Right. I will just control drag like that and then I will delete everything. This is the launch screen, meaning that when you open the app, you will show that. OK, so like that. OK, so we have that right. 